Now, what's up, guys? Back for another video. I have an area I kind of want to lower down today. I don't know how it looks on camera, but if you in real life, if you step around, it is still up to your kind of up to here on your leg. If you can see that. So, we do want to um, get that done probably just to get it down. I want to get that stuff over there by the tree we needed down so it's kind of clean in that area. Also, in the back there, you can see that'll get taken down too. So, we'll just get this whole thing on video and see what it looks like. Let's get it. <laughs> All right, so you can see the change on camera there. Um, what we got going is we got a mulch area in front of us. This is how it's gonna remain. Um, I could bring a blower out here for fun and see what I could blow off, but I think it's gonna remain like this so you can walk on it now. The main issue here is it's really um, dangerously unlevel. And if I have it like I did, the grass seems to all grow to the same height, which makes it seem level. Um, like there's a big dip right there. You can't see it on camera, but you can in real life right there. Um, yeah, so we're going to continue on this. I'm even going to get down there. Um, not any further than the garbage can, though. We're just going to get around a garbage can. And that's about it. <laughs> more string I didn't come prepared so I'll be right back and we did get the project done. Um, look at this. Got it all down where we can walk on top of it. This was actually one of them things that's gonna look really easy on video, but it was hard. The weed eater wasn't liking it. <laughs> Messy, but yeah, it looks a lot nicer now. It's fresh down to the ground. We can step right over everything. Um, yeah, even down here, which was a crazy part, there was a lot of thick grass down here, which is all cut now, down at the end, as you can see. And that thick grass matches what's down over here, which we had, I think a bug on me somewhere, which I had, uh, we had mowed last year. Look how big some of that's getting. 
It's almost up to the trunks on that willow, which we had cleaned up last year and moved all to that other willow, but we don't need to use that this year, so we just kind of let it grow back in. And that's what's going on in this area, but we did take care of this area, so. Man, down here too, you can see, this was actually the hardest, and this is why, this is why, look at that hole, you could fall right in, so that's why I did this, so it kind of helps us know where things are, but look how big some of these weeds are that I haven't, that's what this whole field would look like if it wasn't mobile. But down here, this bucket stinks like poop, because there's poop in there. Um, and just kind of came in through this area and mowed it all down so it's all exposed. That barbed wire is exposed because it's a little closer than the rest, so we want to make sure that it's exposed. So yeah, that's that's that. That's the end of season mow or weedied. This place, this yard is done for the end of season um, weedied. It is completely done. Um, except maybe a couple areas here. I don't think I'll film though. Um, it's mowed, weeded for the year, so we're done. What triggered me to do this project was I got stabbed earlier by a sharp, pokey weed. So um, yeah. Anyway, we are done. See you guys in the next one.